In today's video, we'll show you how to add an LED with your Cayenne app. Here you see the mobile dashboard with the LED widget, and you can see us being able to control, turning on and off, the LED light straight from our phone. Here are the items you'll need. A Raspberry Pi with Cayenne installed, GPIO ribbon cable, Pi cobbler, breadboard, LED, a resistor, and all the wires you need to connect. Here we'll show you how to connect the LED to your Pi. Here are a couple of notes before you get started. Make sure your Raspberry Pi is powered off when connecting wires. When using GPIO ribbon cable, make sure the power wire is connected to the corner of your Raspberry Pi at the top corner of your Pi cobbler. The provided diagram is just an example of how to connect the sensor. There are many ways to connect sensors and extensions, so try what works best for you. Some full-size breadboards have a power line that is separated in the middle. If this is the case, be sure your sensors are connected on the same half of the breadboard as your Pi cobbler. Step 1. Connect the LED positive leg, the longer of the two legs, from a resistor to a GPIO pin. In this example, it's pin 23. Step 2. Connect the LED ground leg, the shorter of the two legs, to the GND pin from the Pi cobbler. Here you'll see a visual of an LED connected to your Pi. Now open your Cayenne app to add the LED light. Go to your Cayenne app, tap Add Device, tap View All Actuators, tap Light, tap Light Switch, And if you need to, you can view the tutorial, enter the widget name, choose the widget and icon, select Integrated GPIO, and select the channel, channel 23, and choose Invert Logic, and tap Add Sensor. And once you do that, you'll see the LED widget added to your dashboard. You can tap the widget on and off to control the light remotely. Thanks for watching. To see more videos, visit community.mydevices.com.